왔다. 그래? 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 Musta motoristas! Last episode, we excitedly boarded another Roro going to the island province of Catanduanes, also known as the Happy Island. We were greeted by a riders club and had some sumptuous lunch and dessert at Sandy's Blossoms. If you haven't seen it, click the link above. If it's your first time here, my name is JT and I have accepted a personal challenge of touring the 81 provinces of the Philippines on two wheels within three years. I track my progress by putting markers on my printed map. Make sure to check out my adventures on the video section of the channel. Because our launch took more time than expected, we decided to skip Luyang Cave due to a very limited time. According to the locals, it would take about an hour to really get the most out of the cave visit. But we still decided to stop by and just take some photos just to have something to remember it by. Our next stop is Hitoma Lake in Karamoran, then to Cagnipa Rolling Hills in Pandan, and finally back to Karamoran to check in at Bigilas Inn. We chose to go back 10 kilometers because it's the only accommodation nearby that we can find which has air-conditioned rooms. We actually don't mind fine rooms, but since we're not sure about the weather, we took the AC room so we can have a better rest for the night. We left and said goodbye to the manager of the store for the last time. Ericsson, the one with the Mio Sporty, left the group temporarily to go straight to Viga, where he will spend time with some relatives. According to him, his scooter now is in good condition and he's gonna be fine. I just told him to call us in case any problem occurs. He will rejoin the group tomorrow morning. After a few kilometers is the entrance to Luyang Cave. You have to go down the stairs to access the cave. Kiki, do you love me? Are you riding? After the group shot, we left. The locals mentioned this coastal area from San Andres going to Paramoran. And this is where it sunk in that we really are trying to circumnavigate an island. After enjoying again some twisties, we stopped for a while to appreciate the beauty right in front of us. We then decided to proceed and wait for the others somewhere else. While riding in this residential area, my phone rang. When I tried to answer it, it got disconnected. When I stopped to check my phone, there was no network signal. So we went back a few hundred meters and looked for a spot where there's signal. 
I got to talk to Torvik and apparently something was wrong with Lady Raider Rider's bike. They can't figure it out yet so they looked for a mechanic. Luckily, there was an experienced one nearby. They told me that we didn't have to go back for them and we'll just meet them at Hitoma Lake. Good thing there were 5 of them. So what, Nabuhay Miles and Winnie the Pooh and I went ahead. Since the Hitoma Lake wasn't still on Google Maps, we searched for it the old-fashioned way. Yup, by asking people for directions. Unfortunately, the place was not yet that popular, so most of the people we asked about it were either clueless or pointed us in the wrong direction. Good thing a group of locals directed us to the correct way. The assigned staff was not there but the neighbors were more than willing to assist us. They called this person who guided us to the lake. Okay, yeah. and we just got here sa Hitoma Lake. Yeah. Nahinarangan nila. <laughs> I love Hitoma Lake. There. Okay, so tatambay tayo sandali dito. Sarap mag-senti doon, no? Yung pagkatapos ng break-up, wala kang gustong kausapin, magbumukmo ka lang doon, no? May dala kang pundador. <laughs> Siyempre, punta tayo doon. Why? Para marupok, brother! Yeah. Oo. Oh, <laughs> sa isa lang kami. Sa isa lang kami, parang tuyong-tuyo yung ano eh, bamboo eh. Ano ka naman lumangoy, di ba? Hindi eh. <laughs> <laughs> Saan pa punta? Ayun, no? Game na. Tara. Ito ay tong Wow! Woo! Yeah. Ayun no? Woo! Ano ang buhaya dito kuya? More squeaking? Wow! Ganda oh. Wala rin po ba dito? Ang nangilig lang yan. <laughs> Gano'n ka babaw ka? Ang lig ng pato. Pato. <laughs> ah, lig ng pato. Ayos. Parang pandin lake din bro. San Pablo, di ba? May lumulutang na ano. Na? Palaka? Hindi. Ano ko? OMG. <laughs> Madami nga sila actually kahit dun sa kabilang side. Ano yung ito mo rin? Oo, oh, kaya tinatanong po kung ano siya. So, pwede kayong mag-lunch dito or mag-meals or merienda. Tapos sina-enjoy nyo yan. Oo, oh, ganda. Puntaan natin yung ano. Boss, nagpapapayag po kayo magpaluto dito. Ah, so pwede palang magpaluto dito, tapos dyan na nga kayo kakain. This is apparently a project of Bifar. So marami ditong mga farm, fish farm actually. So nauna kami dito, ayan, natira sa amin si Sowat, si Winnie the Pooh, tsaka si, si Nabuhay Miles. Apparently si... Lady Raider Rider, nagka-problema sa... Sabi ng mekaniko, parang bearing yata. Yun ang uh, diagnosis ng mekaniko. Pero aalamin pa daw niya, baka sa clutch yung tama. Anyway, in short, nakatigil sila doon. Inaayos yung motor. Kaya nauna kami dito. In a while, alis na rin kami kasi kailangan namin umabot ng sunset sa Cagnipa Rolling Hills. Mga labatanis daw doon, kaya excited kami. Sana magawa na agad yung motor ni Lady Raider Rider para makasunod sila agad doon. And ma-enjoy namin sabay-sabay yung sunset. By the way, I knew about this through Cara, Cara Santos, you know her, the blogger that uh, inspired me to do the 81 provinces. Nilagyan ko lang ng twist, ginawa kong on two wheels. Before leaving, we called the others to ask for updates. The mechanic said there are balancer springs missing and the repair will take time. The group then decided that we proceed to the last destination, the Cagnipa Rolling Hills.
it was still full of twisties and the road was full of parts with sandy areas which made it dangerous if you lean on corners. In short, it took more time to get to the rolling hills and before we know it, the sun is setting fast. Wala kaming tigil para maabutan ng maliwanag ang lugar. We heard that the view there was beautiful. You need to walk for a few hundred meters according to the locals. But they never mentioned the particular kind of path we need to go through. We were just a few more kilometers away. But Nabuhay Mouse is almost out of gas so he overtook us to find any gas stations. Dahil lumampas si Miles sa lilikuan, so what decided to follow him so we can lead him back to which turn they should take so they can follow us. So that leaves me and Winnie the Pooh. And there it was, the start of another unforgettable off-road experience. I almost slid a few times but I was too determined to make it to the end. Upon seeing this steep rocky area, I waited for Winnie the Pooh. He seemed to be willing to continue so I myself continued as well. more of this crazy terrain. I asked for directions and they pointed me to this seemingly empty narrow road. Apparently, it is already the entrance going to the hills. And yep, we are to leave our bikes right here. Winnie the Pooh arrived shortly. <gasps> Finally! <laughs> so, kita nyo na may pinagdaanan namin kanina. Pero, para sa vlog, dire-diretso pa rin kami. Medyo hapitan. So, kita nyo tong maliit na daan na to. Dito raw nagpa-park yung mga motor kaya iniwan namin dito. Sabi naman itong mga nene, Safe naman daw dito. Kaya dito namin iiwan yung mga motor. Tapos dito ang daan namin. No? Yan. Hanggang dun daw paakyat. Tapos dun sa taas. May pababa ulit. Yun na yun. Let's go. Bago pa magdilim. So dun kami galing. Yan yung pinaba namin yung matarik. Tapos dito. Hanggang dito. Dito naman tayo. Ito may makakapita namin. Okay. Yes, adventure kami. Ayun, kita ko na. Nasa is. Sunset. Kati. Tumusok sa kamay ko. Wala signal. Wa-warning ako sana sila eh. Gaya nga kayo. Nalate kami. Hello. This is it. Ito yung pinaghirapan namin. Ito. Kita niya yan. Ayun! Bro! Tinatokag ang kita, walang signal! Ha? Seryoso! So what unfortunately had a flat tire? I thought we finally made it. Meron pa palang masukal na daan na kailangan pasukin para makapunta sa kabilang side. I was skeptical at first because who knows what's on the other side, right? But I still continued. Ganda na dito palang, pero kailangan mo pa yata maglakad dun. Dun kasi dun nga yung pa parang view and deck nila. Ganda ng sunset oh. So lakad muna tayo. Let's go. Ganda dito. From there. Ito yata yung daan. What the? Masukal. Huh? What? Seryoso ba to? Sa <laughs> Alam niya. Here we go again. Buhis buhay moves. With boy decisions. 
Okay, sige. Kung makalain, may mga ganito pa pala dito. Ah! Ah, may bahay. Ay, ano mang di dito? Ano mang akit pa doon? Or, tama ba? Tao po! Tao po! Ang ganda. Ayan, kaya tanpa ba doon? Parang meron eh. Pero, parang wala nang tutunguhan. May mga matatalas din ito. Matalas siya. So, I'll just stay here. Maybe. Ito na tayo mag-shoot ng drones. Tao po! Lahat ang tao. Manok. Ito tayo sa beach area. Para hinahapon natin yung liwanag. Laksong hangin. So, I'm not sure if we can shoot drone dito. What? Ang dumi! Imagine yan. Puro basura oh. Wow. Boss! Paano umakyat? Parang hindi na maganda. Parang kung ka paakyat oh. Paakyat dun. Mataas pa yung masyado masukal. Mataas pa po! Yung maikli, maliit na ano, masukal? Nakatakot <laughs> eh. There's no more time so I flew my drone from there and see what's on the top. I packed my drone as quickly as I can and rushed on my way back before it gets really dark. The phone finally caught some signal and nabuhay miles cold. They are now bringing it to a vulcanizing shop. Okay, pamunta na ako dyan. Pakit na ako. Okay, bye. Grabe ang sukal pala nito. Wala tayong ilaw masyado. We need light. Yung mga pinaggagawa ko sa buhay ko, di ba? Pero that's the best that I could do. Guys, hindi tayo nakaakyat pero hopefully okay naman yung drone shots. <sighs> Let's go. Dito sa masukal na daan na to. Ilaw. Flashlight from my phone. Ito nga lang mo dito eh. Holy sh**. Saan na? Ah, dito. Fart. Okay. Ito nga ba? Ito yan. Ito nga. Yes, ito nga. Huh. Okay, I survived. Hanapin ko na si Winnie the Pooh. I finally made it back. We're not out of the woods yet. We had to go through that rough terrain again and this time without sunlight. Next episode. See you next time.